take to bring down the bat? What the hell? Who's out there? Oh crap! Drive! Drive! It's Batman! Oh god, Batman! He's tailing us! Boy, try to lose him! I'm trying! Put your foot down! He's gaining on us! has a stockpile of arms near the fish market of Dresden. Same drill as before. You got it. You got ammo? Yeah. Bobby? I'm good. How about you, Knuckles? You hear that? What? You could have swore I heard something. That's the wind blowing through your ears. Beat me. Hey, pipe down, boys. Peaks is doing out front. He was pissed he got guard duty. Can't wait to... Don't we 
you doing here, man? Tried to merge. I was being rhetorical. You been sleeping in the dictionary or something? Prime looting to be done out there. Yeah, well, I'll be sure to put in a complaint when the boss comes back. Just saying. Just remember one thing. We're still working for Penguin. What do you think? I'm stupid. No, but you ain't shut up about Two-Face all night. I'm just curious about the score he's taken down. Well, don't be. You hear me? I hear you. I won't be satisfied until I bring Penguin to justice. You always were great at killing a party. Imagine Penguin's not too happy with us right now. Can only have a couple of these weapon caches left. Keep looking. Let me know as soon as you find anything. Of course. I wouldn't miss seeing the look on his face for the world. I'm headed to Divinity Church. Riddler won't give up, Alfred. His pride will matter. You'll break his spirit, sir. I've every confidence. Unexamined life is not worth living, Detective. And I've been wondering why I let you aggravate me so. You're a cheat and a liar. A dressed up strong man playing with expensive toys. World's greatest detective. Ha! And everyone from Gotham to Star City believes it. I cannot abide a fraud, Detective. A dilettante masquerading amongst his intellectual betters, stealing every last scrap of appreciation, dignity, and respect. Detective, to the drain I'm going to figuratively and quite possibly literally flush you down. 
The goal of this aquatic examination could not be simpler, detective. Lower the water like so. Before that, however, it's time for a riddle. Riddle me this, detective. What do bats do when they're at home? Detective, do you have a death wish? Is it merely incompetence in carrying out said inclination that has kept you alive so long? I think you're getting the hang of it. might be lower, but you're still out of your depth. death was inevitable, I'm afraid. A statistical certainty. your car. I'd swap insurance details, but I expect you'll be dead by morning.
Since that car is quite clearly an extension of your <clears throat> ego, I thought you'd take better care of it. Struggling, detective? <laughs> I'm afraid you're running several minutes behind my projection. Ah! This is why my projections were off. I failed to consider both your incompetence and your stupidity as two distinct variables. Apologies, detective. I will recalculate post-haste. You are barely keeping up to the precise degree my equations predict. Careful on your way out. Hey, Eddie. Can't we play a different game? This one's getting old. Ready to die, my Ready dear? Die, die, die. Here's hoping Eddie hasn't started cheating. And they say black cats are bad luck. Another key, well done. D of course, you'll lose all nine lives in an instant should I push this detonator. Another door unlocked. What a surprise. been the smartest man in the room, detective, forced to endure the suspicions and mockery of those whose meager mental faculties prohibited them from appreciating that fact. And then you appear in Gotham, dressing up your cognitive capabilities, marginally superior as they are to that of the average hoodlum, in the guise of a crusading hero. And oh, how the people swoons. To the orphanage, hero! It's time to rejoin Catwoman for another try. Wait, 
think Scarecrow's got enough. You're back. I said I'd get you out of here. I know. It's just... Nothing. Let's get to the next room, okay? Before my head explodes. Well, hello again to my favorite comedy double act. Double, double. I'd just like to say what a novelty it's been constructing riddle chambers for two half-wits instead of one. Why, that's practically a whole wit between you. <laughs> Dark Knight, when you failed your feline friend and are done mourning over her headless corpse, headless corpse. perhaps we'll do this again with, uh, Robin? <laughs> or maybe that prodigal son of yours over in Bloodhaven. Can you get up there? The ceiling? Easy. me this. Can a maze still amaze if it doesn't have walls? If it doesn't have walls. Stuck you two? Stuck you when the answer strikes you, it'll be like a cartoon light bulb flashing above your head. to disable a security system like this when I robbed Queen Industries. Never mind. Halfway there. Now for a final twist. 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 Catwoman, good. That pain is what stupidity feels like. Stupidity feels like. Oh, Eddie, you're going to feel very, very stupid when I catch up with you. Done on this side. Okay, run over here. 
Congratulations. And now your reward. Robot. Seriously, Eddie, how much longer is this going to take? Well, how clever the pair of you must feel. How smug. Well, I hate to intrude upon this miserable little moment of victory, but I wanted you to be aware you're very unlikely to see one another again. Catwoman, the Batman will fail you, because waiting for him beneath Ronala Ferry Terminal is my greatest trial. Batman, are we... Don't let what Riddler said get to you. Eddie is an idiot, but he's an idiot who built a series of underground death traps across the city. And? And, I just wanted to say, be safe. This is definitely your mess, and I appreciate you cleaning it up. But just be careful while you do it, okay? This is your chance with Catwoman, Batsy. She's vulnerable, trapped in an abandoned orphanage. That sure spells romance to me. Speaking of which, I went back to the afterlife to check on Talia, and, uh, well, we got to talking about how you basically murdered us both. She started crying, so I went to comfort her, and, well, before I knew it, one thing led to another, and, <laughs> uh, you know. Thing is, Talia and I just want you to be happy. I tell the little pussycat how you feel while you still can, Patsy. Because when I take over your body and lock you away in a tiny little corner of your mind, I'll kill her first. The alarm's been tripped at the Bank of Gotham treasure branch. Two-Face's crew are trying their luck, sir. 